A Russian IL-20M Ilyushin 20M aircraft lands at an unknown location. The plane is similar to one that was shot down Tuesday over northwestern Syria. Alexander Kopita AFP Getty Images updated at 9 a.m. ETA Russian surveillance plane carrying 15 people was accidentally shot down over northwestern Syria by regime forces, Russia's Ministry of Defense says. However, officials in Moscow are blaming Israel for the incident, which killed all 15 service members on board. The Defense Ministry says the turboprop Il-20 Kut, used for electronic reconnaissance disappeared from radar near the coastal city of Latakia on Tuesday just as Israeli F-16s were launching airstrikes on targets in the area. In a series of tweets on Tuesday, the Israel Defense Forces, or YDF, blamed extensive and inaccurate Syrian anti-aircraft fire. Russian Defense Ministry, Russian Ilyushin Il-20 plane was downed by Syrian air defense missile after Israeli F-16 pilots used it as cover thus setting it up to be targeted by AA defense. Such actions can only be classified as a deliberate provocation https colon slash slash t dot co slash qbcqpz 2 n 6 pig dot twitter dot com slash 21 mttnxmpd russia in rsa russia at embassy of russia september 18, 2018 the trace of the eel 20 on flight control radars disappeared during an attack by four israeli f-16 jets on syrian facilities in latakia province the russian defense ministry said in a statement Russian Defense Ministry spokesman Igor Konoshenko off said the F-16s were hiding behind the Russian aircraft, and that the Israeli pilots put the Russian plane in the line of fire of Syrian anti-aircraft systems, a Syrian S-200 surface-to-air missile brought down the plane, the ministry said. We view these provocative Israeli actions to be hostile, Konoshenkov was quoted by Interfax as saying in a translation published in the Moscow Times. Fifteen Russian servicemen died as a result of the irresponsible actions of the Israeli military, he added. Konoshenko off said Russia reserves the right to take appropriate retaliatory measures, but he provided no specifics. At the same time Russian air control radar systems detected rocket launches from the French frigate Auvergne which was located in that region, the Russian ministry said in a statement, but a French military spokesman denied the warship had any involvement in the shooting down of the Russian plane. IDF tweeted that when the Syrian army launched the missiles that hit the Russian plane, IF jets were already within Israeli airspace during the strike against the target in Latakia. The Russian plane that was then hit was not within the area of the operation, the tweet said. An initial inquiry of the incident suggests 1. Extensive and inaccurate Syrian anti-aircraft surface-to-air missile fire caused the Russian plane to be hit and downed, Israel Defense Forces added spokesperson September 18, 2018 to When the Syrian army launched the missiles that hit the Russian plane, IF jets were already within Israeli airspace. Point three. During the strike against the target in Latakia, the Russian plane that was then hit was not within the area of the operation, Israel Defense Forces added spokesperson September 18, 2018 4. The Syrian anti-air batteries fired indiscriminately and from what we understand, did not bother to ensure that no Russian planes were in the air, Israel Defense Forces added spokesperson September 18, 2018 Syrian state media reported that Latakia came under attack at about the same time that the Il-20 disappeared as it was heading for a nearby Russian air base. Syrian media say Syrian air defense batteries responded to enemy missiles. Russia's TASS news agency quoted the ministry as saying the plane was about 20 miles off the Syrian coast in the Mediterranean Sea when it went down.